Hey guys, wanted to go ahead and do this uh, lure pression, it, and it's just a, a single packet, you know, it's not the food packet, and this is oriental style spicy chicken with uh, vegetables and rice. And I, I want to go ahead and do something different. I, I've seen before guys just cutting off the top and uh, pouring the 16 ounces of water, which is uh, two cups of water and you know letting it rehydrate and all that but I, I, on another guy's channel I cannot remember uh, what it was he had one of these and this is a, a GSI outdoors uh, collapsible uh, mug or cup and I thought it was a uh, pretty ingenious and it it actually held the quantity of this including the two cups of water so I'm gonna go ahead and try it out for myself and uh, see how it works out okay let's get the party started and literally that's what it looks like just some uh, rice vegetables and uh, dehydrated chicken Give it a couple of good scrunches. And there it goes. And I've got my water all set. Seat settling nicely. has a really good smell to it too so there you go almost right up to the top but that's good okay now we're gonna go ahead and give it a stir I've got one of these uh, stainless steel chopsticks kind of ironic seeing how this is oriental but it really gets down to the bottom and you can use this with your uh, MRE bags and mountain house as well so there we go we got it nicely stirred Side for a second. Now I'm going to go ahead and secure the lid. Lid is secured, and now we're just going to go ahead simply wait. These uh, chopsticks are kind of neat. Uh, they're very light, and the best part about it is you can unscrew them. So uh, you can put them with your kits if you have a kit or something like this. Okay, guys, it's been about 10 15 minutes since I went ahead and uh, poured the water in. So let me go ahead, I'll reassemble my chopstick so I can give it a nice little stir up. Uh, you do have to kind of be careful. This is a little flimsy on the bottom, so just uh, don't use too much force. And it uh, looks like the steam vent worked really good. And boy, that smells really good. Looks like we have some uh, green beans, some mushrooms, uh, peppers, carrots, and some chunks of chicken mixed in with the rice. Ordinarily, something like this, I'd probably go ahead and, and mix in some like Asian Five Spice or something like that. But this really does not uh, smell like it needs it. So let's uh, let's use our chopsticks and we put it back together. Give it all a good stir. Make sure that it's all incorporated. Everything feels like it's uh, like it's pretty well cooked through. So let's go ahead. And give us give you. Taste. Well, right, that is really good. And some of these green beans didn't really look like they constituted real well, but they really did. Uh, I would say this uh, GSI collapsible mug has a uh, really uh doing real well man i've got a dog right here saying come on feed me the other nice thing about this is now you have a handle so you can just dig right in and chow down and wow i mean this smells really good so if you get your hands on one of these cups or in a one of these dehydrated alert rations or not even a alert ration any mountain house product it's it's packed by the same exact people so this will be something that's real easy to clean too. So there you go. Just something different. 
and uh, thanks for watching.